it's the end of the weekend But I still wanna turn up Yeah, I still wanna turn up All I want is to go again But you ain't picking your phone up Why you messing my head up? Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Caviar Kez. I hope you're all doing well. Today's hair sponsor is Hair Spells. I have worked with them, I believe, once before. Today what I have installed is a 22 inch 5x5 HD closure wig. This is in the Indian curly texture. It's been a long time since I've reviewed like Indian hair. Where are you? Where are you? Don't hide away from me when I need you most. We got love guarantee and I have to know. Say. I made reservations Too many invitations And the last night was heavy, heavy. I need come So this wig comes pre-cut, ready to wear It's a dome cap Vacation. Used to talk 24-7 Every other second Just to make sure we were up to date Now it's closer to 11 So the glueless fit is really good on this wig and the HD lace is looking good, you guys. So I did bleach the knots on this wig. So when I'm doing my lazy girl plucking, I am plucking in sections, but I'm also like moving the tweezer around. I'm not plucking in the same spot twice. So pluck one here, I'll go over here. I'll pluck behind, I'll go up. You know, we're just moving it around. And then I like to pull the hair forward and have a look see and see where where i'm plucking okay so look at the difference so that is the side that's plucked this is the part that isn't okay and then i'm gonna do that for this side as well What do I always say guys? I don't like too much baby hairs, right? So we just want just the right amount. You gotta be careful too when you're cutting those baby hairs because if you cut them too short, you're not gonna be able to curl them. Like I was struggling to curl the other side. So don't be like me and do that. Okay guys. So for this little part here that's sticking out, you can you can go in with like a black shadow or dark brown. It's a beautiful glueless wig. So I don't wanna mess it up with putting glue because you really don't need to. I'm gonna go in with some of that gel because we plucked that hairline. So because we plucked that hairline, we wanna showcase it. Of course, I'm gonna do a middle part because that's what we do over here. Before we move forward, I'm gonna go in with some powder that looks like scalp. Clean up that part. A 
Okay, so I'm gonna go in with some gel. And I'm gonna use the Eco Style gel. Just put a bit on there. We don't necessarily need it everywhere right now because the hair is still defined. I'm gonna go in with some water. Okay. Okay, we're going to do that for this side. I like my tips really defined, my wigs really defined. So guys, I did cut some layers on this side here. So I just took like this section here. Cause see how this is like giving straight, but this is giving like fuller here. So we just take some pieces like that, cut it. Just adding some long layers. My final thoughts on this wig is it is absolutely gorgeous. It looks so much better when you give it a haircut and it's pretty easy to do this cut, you guys. You saw me do it on my head. If I take this off, I probably wanna add some more layers at the back here and things like that, but mostly the layers are in the face, face framing, and it looks so pretty. It's a shorter length, so I don't mind cutting into my shorter wigs to give it the look that I need. And it is a glueless wig, guys, HD, and it's giving, like it's giving what lace look at that we did bleach the knots on this wig before we even got to this point today and i also plucked the hairline so i did my lazy girl plucking and i think this really makes a difference it just really makes the wig look more natural and realistic so let me know what you guys think in the comment section below would you try something like this until next time guys bye